Prince Harry and wife Meghan Markle are loving their new family of four with son Archie, two, and baby Lilibet, but they are experiencing the challenge of finding that elusive work-life balance, revealed Meghan's makeup artist Daniel Martin. The Duchess friend claimed the family had struck a rhythm as a foursome. Meghan has recently been lobbying the U.S. Congress in an attempt to get them to introduce paid family leave for Americans. Daniel said, it's about finding that work-life balance now. They're experiencing it themselves. The couple, who have largely been on parental leave since the birth of six-month-old Lilibet in June, currently live in a $14 million mansion in California. The couple's work has been under question recently as their £18 million Spotify deal has so far only seen them produce 35 minutes of content. The pair also have a Netflix contract that industry insiders claim could be worth as much as £100 million. Back in March this year Prince Harry announced that he had taken on a corporate role for a Silicon Valley startup as their chief impact officer. While the salary for this job is unknown, it's thought similar positions would be offered a six- or seven-figure salary. In addition to these ventures the family also have several book deals, worth up to £29 million. But even with these huge deals, makeup artist Daniel said the couple were funny when he saw them to do Meghan's makeup for the gala at the Intrepid Museum in November. Daniel said, Harry jokes around a lot, and Meghan is really funny. It was nice to have those belly laughs again. They are loving life as a family of four. They've struck a rhythm as a foursome. It's about finding that work-life balance now, which ties into Meghan lobbying for parental paid leave. They're experiencing it themselves. They know it affects everyone in the family. Harry and Meghan quit royal duties in March 2020 for new lives of personal and financial freedom across the pond. They carried out a series of high-profile engagements while in the Big Apple. In November, they returned to New York to attend the Intrepid Museum's Salute to Freedom Gala in New York. Former Suits star Meghan stunned in a red dress for the event honoring veterans. The Duchess also recently contacted U.S. politicians to push for paid family leave. Back in August, royal biographer Omid Scobie said the pair were entering the era of visibility. They're a couple who do very well in those moments of human interaction. They need to be on the ground. They say that the proof is in the pudding, and what we are about to see is that pudding. Meghan caused a stir by using her Duchess title while lobbying the U.S. Congress in an attempt to get them to introduce paid family leave for Americans. Buckingham Palace officials called her move outrageous as members of the royal family should not exert their influence in another country's politics. Harry and Meghan welcomed baby Lilibet into the brood back in June, and have since embarked on a whirlwind tour of New York and signed lucrative deals with Netflix and Spotify. Meanwhile, Harry has taken on a job as chief impact officer for a Silicon Valley startup called BetterUp, the salary is thought to be at least six figures. Meghan has appeared on The Ellen Show to chat about her humble beginnings with longtime pal Ellen DeGeneres, and signed book deals worth up to £29 million. Despite their taxing work life and parental responsibilities, Daniel said the couple were funny when he did Meghan's makeup for a winter gala at the Intrepid Museum. Harry jokes around a lot, and Meghan is really funny. It was nice to have those belly laughs again.